Hello you. You might notice that this isn't the usual start to a video where I show you the cover of the box and then well, that's because I don't have a copy of well to be a legit copy. I have this copy which is disc number 187 of my original I say original discs that I got off bloke at school when I uh, bought my disc drive and uh, Altered Beast is on side A. Tiger Road and Batman is on side B. Um, sorry whoever wrote Altered Beast at the time. Um, I never saw it anywhere. Um, I would have bought it, probably, it being a big arcade machine version at the time. I don't remember what the reviews were like. Um, you know what? I'm not even sure if I ever played this version. Because, uh, you know, a box of 300 discs, you pick and choose, and some stuff sits to one side. Um, so, yeah, this might be the first time I ever played this. I don't know. Well, obviously, I've played Altered Beast before. Who hasn't? Of my age, shall we say. That's... Uh, Derbyshire Ram, apparently, and I've already read the important note, apparently there were problems with the crack in that if they put an intro on it, it buggered up all the time, but apparently now it's fixed. So we will go with, um, oh this is the, oh, okay, we'll, we'll go with the intro first, and then we'll go with the plus four game that I guess is the actual file to load for gameplay. Um, yeah, I never saw Altered Beast for sale anywhere. Um, I vaguely recall the um, adverts and the uh, picture of the cover, but um, actually seeing it in the shops, no. Um, this isn't looking too healthy, is it? No, that's not looking too healthy. Well, we will go off and on again. We will go faster, we will do directory. We will go into the game itself. Oh, no, 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 no. Didn't want to do shift one stop. Let's go... Alter Beast plus four. And let's see if this works. Yeah, because I saw um, Collie UK uh, did a live stream recently in sort of, uh, as a celebratory uh, ten years on YouTube thing. And uh, someone got him to play Altered Beast on the Spectrum. Which made me think, oh, Altered Beast, I've not played that in a while. And it looks like I'm not going to be playing it for a while again. By the looks of things, that doesn't seem to be doing much. Okay, let's... one more try. Fast load. Directory. Stop there, please. Stop there, please. Okay. Let's bring up the directory again. There we go. Let's go up to... That and load that. Are you going to work this time? Definition of madness, trying the same thing over and over again and expecting a different. Hang on. Sorry, we have 62 Quintero on the. Okay, you better check out the demo top of the disc. That's not exactly helping. Sorry, we have bleh on. Let's do another directory. Do we have to do the logo for the, the intro first? Because that didn't seem to want to work. Or do I have to load the disc without the fast... Oh, it's... No, still not right. Oh, oh, hang on. Wait a second, what's it doing? Shit, shit, shit. What a real motherfucker to fix all levels were ripped from tape by Sauron. And rest was done by the awesome trio. Yes, trio, Sauron, Garfield and Rocky. Bit surprised, eh? Again, illusion has expanded. Now we've got rock. Yeah, 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 yeah. Scandinavia's number one, apparently. Let's uh, hit space. Uh -huh -huh. Okay, we appear to be working now. So they ripped the levels from tape. And then it yeah, got a disc release from them. Right, uh, space again, I'm guessing? Yeah, Collie UK was doing a live stream for the first time in I don't know how long, and um, I finally caught up with the. Uh, him, oh, here we go. Those eyes don't look right. Normally there's a pupil in them. Uh, okay. Okay, we're doing quite good at copying the arcade, really. Yeah, I, I wasn't really around when Collie UK was um, doing videos before, and uh, sounded like a bit of a laugh, and people recommended him, and I caught him on live stream, and he was doing Alter Beast on the Specky. And I thought it looked quite nice for a Specky game. Um, it looked like lots of detail. The sprites actually looked like all the various enemies in the game. The arcade game. 
it just was horribly slow and juddery and but apparently not very playable. So I'm guessing this is probably going to be pretty similar, but a mess of blocky pixels. Uh, but we shall see. Because uh, let's face it, gameplay side of Alter Beast was never that hot, was it? It was all about the graphics, which you might not think so, but were quite impressive at the time. To the point where um, a friend and I travelled all the way from Bridgend to Port Talbot to a chip shop on the edge of town that had an Altered Beast machine. It was the only Altered Beast machine we knew in a 50 mile area. As far as we knew, it was the only one around. So we travelled all the way to a chip shop in Port Talbot just to play Altered Beast. <laughs> it was that, and it was that good. And we were talking about it in school afterwards. It was really quite something. The graphics were amazing. You turn into a dragon, you punch lightning and all sorts. Ah, oh, it was amazing. Um, I'll press fire. And Ah, oh, there we go, now we're doing something. So obviously that's not going to... Oh, yeah, that's really not going to translate very well, is it? Ah. Yes, anyone? Let's try this again, shall we? Install fast load, F3. Bring that up, let's go back up to... that without the intro. No, you've got to do it with the intro. Damn, where am I on the keyboard here? Let's do that. Let's not hang about on the main menu. Let's just get straight into it and see if... Let's not give it a chance to crash. Um, there we go. There we go. And deep crunching. And there we go. Let's just hammer that fire button to start. Come on, come on, don't crash this time. Come on, come on. You know you want it. You know you want it. No, oh, you bum. <sighs> right. I'm going to stop the camera now and have a quick rummage through my disc box and see if I have another copy because with these sort of things you might have another copy that was done by a different release group and that one worked but you might still have had the one before that didn't work because you never got around to wiping it so um, hopefully we'll carry on a bit longer on this one otherwise I guess this is going in the load fail pile and um, I hope you enjoyed watching the intro to Altered Beast see you anon maybe Well, this seems a bit more promising, doesn't it? It's asking me if I want unlimited lives, and you know what? I'm going to stick the light on. I'm going to go with yes. Uh, and we'll go with... If I can find the yes again. Unlimited energy. Yeah, there we go. Left shift to switch between the human and the beast. I've been rummaging through discs like crazy, unlabeled ones, and eventually found this. It looks like the same cracked copy, but um, it did this when I tried to load it, so that's uh, more promising. <coughs> Not sure whether it's worth half an hour's worth of rummaging through discs, but we shall see. Uh, <clears throat> oh, it's taking its time, isn't it? <clears throat> Come on, crunch that data in. Come on. <sighs> yeah, anyway, so as I was saying. Uh, yeah, Collie UK was playing this on the um, Spectrum, and um, if you didn't see it moving, you'd think it looked quite good. There was no colour clash, everything looked colourful, and um, I thought the sprites looked pretty accurate conversions from the uh, arcade, if simplified, obviously, with the colours. <coughs> but it scrolled like God knows any. It was arthritic, let's say that. Uh, F1, one player, let's see what this is like. <coughs> Rise from your grave! Okay, um, well, scrolling smoothly, possibly a bit too fast because I'm getting run off the screen here. No music, that seems disappointing. Kick the wolf, kick the wolf. Okay, I missed kicking the wolf. Well, we're jumping, um, oh, that's the other type of sort of next level up basic blokey, isn't it? And they're falling from above and... 
Go on, punch him in the knackers. There we go. Okay, well, we'll just walk through that then. <coughs> hmm. Well, I mean, it, it's kind of there, isn't it? It just looks a bit ugly. But you couldn't really do much more than that, could you? I don't know. Punch him in the knackers, there we go. The moves are there, the graphics are about as much as you could have hoped for, really. Playing in almost absolute silence is a bit dull, mind. Let's just jump past him and see if I can... No, I can't quite jump past him. Punch in the knackers, then. Stop bouncing around on the spot. <coughs> this is a problem, isn't it? Okay, well, I'm going to shift to beast mode. See if that um, helps me out of this. There we go, now I'm in beast mode. No, it still doesn't. I appear to be stuck here now. God, is there any volume in this at all? Doesn't seem like it. <laughs> and I appear to be totally stuck. Let's shift out of beast mode and see if I can... The problem with infinite... Should have gone with infinite energy, infinite health, not infinite energy, shouldn't I? Um, Commodore key skip level, restore key skip level, something like that. Aha! Well, that's a good start, isn't it? Hmm. Ooh, we have sound, we have... That's quite nice, really, isn't it? That's, that's quite pretty. Shame the game itself seems a bit... Mm. Mind you, I haven't played the game itself in MAME or any sort of arcade conversion. Is the Amiga version any good? Is the Mega Drive version any good? Don't know. That's the problem, isn't it? I suppose if they ported them accurately... I need to go back and play the original game on MAME, don't I, to find out whether there was actually any decent gameplay there at all, or whether we were just in awe of the graphics at the time. Hmm. I mean, some people say Golden Axe ain't all that. I know it's kind of simplistic back then, but that was really fun, and I still think it's quite good. But, um... Ah, we're on this level. Let's go straight to Dragon Form, shall we? Or whatever the hell... Switch that... Ah, there we go. Right, oh, there we go. Now we're in Dragon Form. Now we can do electrification. I thought we could punt fire lasers forward, couldn't we? Yeah, there's the snakes going from top to bottom, and they're not great big expando sprites like in um, uh, Forgotten Worlds. Ha! Ah. Oh, I made a slight noise then when I picked up that orb. Why is why can you not do the... You can only do that, that is terrible. Ah, knocked your tail off. And stopped you from appearing. I mean, those sprites look like they... scanned from the original and then... But then obviously they go a bit blocky, don't they? Oh, missed them. Maybe if they hadn't sort of scanned the graphics. I mean, that looks, that really does look like it's been scanned from. I think maybe they've tried to do a bit more on the player sprites rather than just scan them in as is. But some of the others kind of lose a bit of the detail and look a bit messy. Those really do look like they've been scanned. I'm sure they have. Probably taken photographs of the arcade machine and then photocopied those and then tried to copy. Right, get up close to him and he turns into. Of course he does. Can we do anything to attack him without the lightning attack though? This is. Hmm. Because there are two levels. Can I press space to fire or something? That's. Wagging joystick. How the hell am I supposed to attack with... Am I supposed to just 
shoot these eyeballs. I can't seem to do anything to kill him. How are you supposed to attack when you can't fire forwards? I'm just going to hammer some keys, see if anything... Look, I can punch and I can jump now. Can I jump up and punch him? Of course not, because you shouldn't be at this point be able to tackle the boss until you've powered up into your altered beast form. Hmm. hmm. Bang the dragon form. No. I just can't get over the silence of the game. Can I just hammer him there like that? Oh, yes, I can. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Takes your power, buggers off, and you jump down after him. And on we go. Do we get another nice, pretty cutscene? Yes, we do. Got it on a cross up there. Maybe not across because you can't see the top of it. That's something I I built something rather similar to that this weekend. I actually finally made a um a decent sign for the uh, for the front gate, so hopefully couriers won't drive past thinking my gateway is an entrance to a field. They will instead will drive past going bugger that I'm not going up there for a laugh. He can come to the depot to collect his stuff. <clears throat> but yeah, it looks like a great big wooden gibbet, really. Not far off real size crucifix. <laughs> I could have probably made it a bit smaller, but eh, when I picked up the wood at the uh, hardware merchants, builders merchants of the wood, it seemed like sensible to go, well, yes, let's have the big, block, biggest, chunkiest wood around, because that will last longer, not thinking how much extra work it would take sawing the bloody stuff. But there we go. Okay then. Oh, it's this one with those strange waspy creatures, isn't it? And yeah, these graphics don't look quite so hot, do they? Oh, no, I can't remember what piece was it. A bear? Yes. Look, we've turned into Bungle. Yes, this this was particularly shit, wasn't it? Yes. <laughs> look, you turned into a bear on the. Oh, look, and you're you're nicked from Golden Axe, aren't you? Oh, look, I'm a bear with halitosis. I forgot. Oh dear, oh dear. You know, I said sorry earlier to people who made this. Um, I, I, I think you ought to be sorry back as well. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure there were probably reasons why this ended up like this. But, oh, okay, maybe not the person who made it, but probably the the so-called important guy in the suit who uh, paid someone to do this and then took the money for it and. Hmm. Although, to be honest, what were you thinking trying to convert something like Alter Beast to the 8 bits? Mm, I wonder what the Amstrad version is like. Right. And the Specky version looked okay. This is. I mean, I don't want to slate it because I can see work's gone into it and it does look. The graphics do look like a downgraded version of the original graphics. Yeah, that's what I think of you, mate, and I'm just going to bounce up and down like this. What the hell is that? Oh, yeah, it was a snaily sort of thing, wasn't it? Uh, let's just keep jumping into it now. Sonic Super Spin Attack, come on. Oh, yes, I forgot. Look, he, look at him when he ducks down. <laughs> Honestly. Barnaby the bear's my name. Never call me Jack or Jane because it's Barnaby. <laughs> Birds taught me to sing when they took me to their king. And I know no other words from that song. <clears throat> but that's been in my head for a very long time. <sighs> I just trying to get up to him. Come on, so I, I want to do that spinning... spinning attack. Come on, do the spinning attack again. Why aren't you doing the spinning attack? Why are you jumping in and breathing on him? 
Aha! Now he's doing it. Uh, it doesn't seem to be doing any good. So I'm going to go next level. I can't remember which key it was. No, it's not any of these keys. I've forgotten what level key it is. We are stuck as Bungle fighting some kind of Ammonite with a dragon's head popping out the top of it, perhaps. Oh, for pity's sake. I feel sorry for those people who... I think, you know, I said I hadn't seen it anywhere. I feel sorry for those that did and shelled out for it. Possibly... Oh, oh, he's moving, he's moving. I've got him moving away from me, bad breath. No, he's come back again. Oh, my giddy aunt. And the silence, the silence is, is deafening. They couldn't even be bothered to... to put any sound in it. Or maybe it's because it's hacked. Who knows, maybe there's some atrocious sound in it, really. Come on. You move back a little bit, then move forward again. Get close and then breathe that onto him, and then get close again and breathe on him, and then get knocked back. Oh, hello, they've just changed. What's that all about? Just got to keep knocking him back, I think. No, just stop doing that. I don't want to be doing spinning bear attack. Oh, my... How many giddy ants have I got? As far as I'm aware, only, only the one. I did have another one, which died recently, so... Why does he keep doing the... Right. Oh, right, now it's not hurting him. He's not moving now. And what are those doing? I don't seem to be doing anything to him now. Hmm. Is this having any effect whatsoever? They look like yellow Sonics. Oh, there we go. I was having an effect, apparently. And yuck, 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 yuck. I shall have your orbs, thank you very much. And I shall go, and I shall leave it open just long enough for you to follow me, because I'm a stupid fool. Come on, what's our reward? What's our, what's our nice picture? And, and some sound. Can't quite make it. Is that her on the cross again? With the birds watching her? I'm not quite sure. Comes up and you go, the graphics are pretty, but I can't quite tell what they are. <laughs> Oh, gun, this is terrible, isn't it? <laughs> uh, chin chin. How many more levels? I think we've only got another level, haven't we? <clears throat> you've got a wolf man, you've got dragon, you've got bungle the bear. Isn't it another wolf man type thing again? <clears throat> I just can't remember what the fourth stage is now. Oh well, it'll turn up and I'll go, oh yeah, that one. I remember now. <clears throat> I've come this far, I might as well plough on to the end, eh? Get ready. It's all blue! Oh yeah, those guys are back. Oh look, he fell over. And these guys are back again. I can punch him in the nuts. Here's Wolfie. Get the orb, thank you. I wonder if... It does say play two keys, so at least maybe you, I'm assuming you can play two players simultaneous, like the proper arcade game, and it's not just there to make you think you can, and it's actually so bad that you can't, but um, I'm not fancying uh, starting it again, and uh, I mean, that's quite nice in the background there, that statue, I can't tell what it is, but it looks quite nice. There is a logic there, I'm sure. It looks really nicely drawn. I can't, I can't tell what it is. It, your punches are missing me, my punches are missing you. This this is a rather ineffectual boxing match we're having here. <laughs> this could go on a while. He's missing me entirely, I'm punching him in the nuts. Or trying to punch him in the nuts. It's having no effect, it's all gone a bit Game of Thrones. You know what I mean. There you go, kick you in the shins instead. Uh, oh, no, getting up was a mistake, wasn't it? Oh, there, there we go, he's just wandered off. <laughs> Ah, uh, hello, wolf. 
you know, I could have sworn the first one you collect turns you into a more muscular man and the second one turns you into the altered beast. So, um, oh yeah, I do appear to be green on there now, so, um, oh, tiger, that was it. And you can fly up and down like that. And doesn't that look absolutely terrible? Oh, we appear to be stuck here again like this. How marvellous. Uh, this is a slight flaw of the game, isn't it? Let's, um, can we get, maybe get a punch in? No, we, we don't get a chance to kill him at all. So I'm going to have to skip to the end of the level, which is probably going to be the end of the game then. What is it to skip again? I mean, that tiger, it look, just looks terrible. I can't skip. Because it's the last level, it won't let me skip. <laughs> oh, don't tell me I'm stuck here like this. Oh no, there we go. I was pressing the wrong button. It's dark and I've been traumatised by a bad game. Give me a break. Oh, there we go. The doves will be gripping the orb. And... Was that not the last level? Oh, blimey, battery's about to die. <laughs> I shall quickly switch batteries while this bit is loading. See you in a minute. Absolutely seamless. You'd never know, would you? Let's go. Oh, my... What? Oh, yep. oh sort of hopping satyrs. What the hell is he? It looks like he's got a bag on his head. Maybe the game looks better with a bag on your head. What the hell is that? I don't remember that. Hopping centaurs. Or fawns or something. Yeah, let's stay away from the left hand side of the screen where you end up getting stuck and killed repeatedly. Is that rubble or is that piles of meat in the background? And, um, Pac-Man's gone a bit odd. Right. <clears throat> These graphics probably look quite nice on the original arcade, but downgraded to this resolution and this few colours. Um, not so hot, really. What? Oh, well, they, they, they've got jump kicks and they're going to use them. Oh, there goes odd fish Pac-Man thing. Hmm. Yeah, there's Wolfie again. To give power to the people. Oh, how much longer? <clears throat> somebody must... Somebody probably enjoyed... Oh, look, I'm now in wolf form. I've got a tiny head. I have a tiny head. Look how tiny that is. Ah, there we go. I can zip. At least I've got an attack that goes forwards. So that's something. Show about my tiny head. I'm like... I'm like Pyramid Head from Silent Hill. If Pyramid Head had a head that was tiny. <laughs> oh, it's um is that Bebop or Rocksteady there? I appear to be stuck off screen there. This this is great. <laughs> can I can I come back on screen please? No, you stay off there. <laughs> I've been knocked off the right hand side of <laughs> Right, I need to let him Punch me off the side of the screen, then, then walk off. No, okay, apparently we're fighting off screen now. Or in a different realm. I'm just going to keep pushing. Oh, no, I'm on the right hand side. <laughs> I got pushed off the screen and appeared on the left hand side again. Oh, my word. I mean, I, I, can I really complain about it being a broken game when it's a cracked version? I, I don't know, but I mean, the graphics, I can certainly say. I mean, it's repeated quite badly there as well, isn't it? Um... I'm not sure if I'm doing any luck again. Which one was Bebop and which one was Rocksteady anyway? I can't remember. I haven't read. <coughs> I haven't read. I haven't seen the films. I don't know how long. And I'm not watching the new ones. Oh. Really? This is, this is just all we've got, is it? I can just 
power into him, he can just punch me back. What if I press down and fire? Nothing. Down and right and fire. No, right and fire just does that and knocks him back a bit. Left and fire does that. Up and fire. Oh no, we were we were hurting him. I'm behind you, mate. I'll tell you what, I'll come in front of you. And he sinks into the ground and the dove from above, or the dove from below in this case, flies around in a quite a strange, strange form. Oh, it's gone back down and turned into... Well, she's got a big smile on her face. You've got to give her that. You've got a nice smile, love. <clears throat> Even it does seem to cover half your head. Um, yes, we've seen that one. Yes, that, that was the intro, that was the cut in for the previous level. Hello? <laughs> um, she's now been released from being a dove back into being a woman again. Oh, oh, hello, what? Ah, uh, the end sequence. Crunched down to a resolution where it's not so impressive anymore. Bebop or Rocksteady, whichever it is. He looks more like a My Little Pony fan art there now, really. Oh, hello. It wasn't one man. It was five five identical bald, grinning men with different colour outfits, like they were Power Rangers. And he's going, ah, and then the back and going, oh, news! Right, and um, dad and daughter and zombie bloke dad rose from the grave but no see it was actually just a film and he's taken off his suit and uh sega what you like eh? yeah let's all have a pint or a stein even yes they finished their terrible terrible movie and they're having several pints of foamy lager it would appear so there we are god help us if they ever make a film of altered beast well, there we go, I'm going to press fire there. No, no, that's it. That's your lot. That's Altered Beast on the Commodore 64. I hope you enjoyed it, because I don't think I ever want to go back to it again. <coughs> I will, however, at some point check out the original on main, because I, I feel I ought to. Because um, we did used to enjoy it, and we played it through to completion, and we shoveled 10 peas into it like crazy, and then we had to find a bus home from Port Talbot. Um, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to check out the arcade version to see if that was a decent version, and um, then hopefully maybe someone else can um, tell us what all the other versions are like. Maybe someone who has the Amstrad version, and maybe an ST and Amiga version, and maybe a Master System or Mega Drive or two. Hint, hint. Anywho, that's me done on this. So I shall bid you adieu. I hope you enjoyed watching. Catch you on the next one, maybe. Ta-ta!